This video covers installation details of Thermon's FAK7 kit for tube trays and thermo tube bundles. Receiving, storing, and handling. Inspect materials for damage incurred during shipping. Report any damages to the carrier for settlement. Identify parts against the packing list to ensure the proper type and quantity have been received. And, store in a dry location. The following kit is required for power and end terminations of electrically heated tube trace bundles. One kit is needed per heater and must be ordered separately. Refer to Form PN50136. Individuals installing these products are responsible for complying with all applicable safety and health guidelines. Proper personal protective equipment, or PPE, should be utilized during installation. Contact Thermon if you have any additional questions. Remove the outer jacket and insulation from the end of the tubing bundle. Use caution to not cut heat trace while removing bundle insulation. Ensure a minimum of 101 mm or 4 inches of tubing is available for connection. Deeper end of tubing and make necessary field installation connections. If tubing is electrically heat traced, make up end termination and or power connection per instructions included with appropriate termination kit. Order separate from FAK7. Liberally apply RTV sealant to tubing bundle insulation. For multi-tubes, apply RTV between the tubes. While removing the clear backing from tape, wrap end of tubing bundle with self-vulcanizing tape. Start a minimum of 51 mm or 2 inches above the cut on the outer jacket and continue a minimum of 51 mm or 2 inches along the bare tubing. Overlap the tape at least 50%. If electrically heat traced, it is recommended that the end termination be sealed and placed inside the insulation or at the connection, to assure no moisture enters the bundle insulation. Completed FAK7 kit for tube trace and thermo tube bundles.